Pause where you need to. This is going to be Insight Terminus GM Guide with no fluff. First off, go ahead and spare it all the way to the cave. Once you get into the cave, there are going to be two barrier champions. There is cover there towards the entrance. Take them out and make sure you take care of the smaller ads. Once done, there is one last barrier you can easily gang up as a fire team. And once you're done with that, head down through the cave. You'll now open up into another big open cave. In that cave, you'll want to take out the red bars on your side as quickly as possible. Once down, focus on the snipers and the guys who are throwing grenades from the other side. Use cover where appropriate because you'll also have to worry about the barrier. Once these are done, take out the barrier as a fire team. And at that point, you'll be through to the next area. Once in the room with the plate, shoot Cargan, but make sure you do it from the back so he doesn't stomp you. Take the plate, and there's a lot of other ways to do this, but I would just nuke everything that comes out. Don't worry about leaving anything up. At the end, there'll be two unstoppables that show up, and just go ahead and nuke them with grenades or power weapons. When low, just go ahead and finish it. It's pretty simple. On your way to the next big room, there'll be an area will have goo on the right. Just stay to the left, and it'll be pretty easy not to die there. For the next area, you're going to have multiple waves of champions that come through based on certain key activities that you do so they'll be very repeatable but and it's very easy to kind of get through this but it just takes some time the first thing is when you first come in there is cover in that back area where you can do a lot of this without getting yourself into a lot of trouble there'll be snipers and guys with grenades take those out first then an unstoppable and a barrier go ahead and take those out cargan will then show up go ahead and shoot him from the far end of the map and run back as quickly as possible. Again, the same thing. Bungie, can you do something new here? It's an unstoppable barrier. Just repeat and do exactly what you did before. When the orb drops, just briefly touch it and you'll notice that ads and barriers show up on the other end. Pretty easy to take out, but do it from this end if you want to play it safe. Have one person then take the orb and everyone fall back to the area where you started. And again, once they put the orb in, it's another unstoppable barrier. Again, stop it. It's the same thing over and over again, but just rinse and repeat, do the exact same that you've done before. Once the unstoppable is down, ads will spawn on the far area again. Just ignore those for now. Touch the, the orb that comes down and another barrier and more ads will show up. You know what to do. Once you shoot the red bars on the other end, again, on the far end of the map, take down the barriers. One has a really, really annoying pulse attack. So if you want to, you probably want to take those out one at a time. Once you do that, put the orb in, there's going to be a ton of ads that show up. Just super them, grenade, whatever. Just make sure you take them off as far away as possible because it is a GM and they can't take you out. And then you're done with that. Next, you're going to head down to Cargan. On along the way, there's another Headlix Vex area. Just make sure you take a grenade or something. Be careful about that. Cargan is really simple and you'll have plenty of time. At this point, you should probably have a bunch of revives and be at like 16 minutes, 17 minutes into the GM. So it should be pretty easy to finish up. Take out the first middle plate to drop him down. The plates take about 10 seconds to complete. Be careful when you're on the plate because there are lips there that can stop you. So just be careful if you're trying to retreat. Cargan also has death void goo that you can hide from in the back. So again, if you're in the middle, just run back to the back because that goo will basically just instantly kill you. So stay away from it. Just watch the entire time. Bring Cargan down to 50% health. He goes away. Now take the left plate, since, the first, since that is the hardest plate. Use supers, nukes to, to nuke the edge to as quickly as possible. Then go over to the right plate. Try to do the same thing. If it's too hard, wait for your regen of your supers and ammo. Take that right plate. Then take the middle plate, and it's the last, and it's the easiest one where you can hide back. At that point, you finish all the mechanics, just have to plink at Karg until he's dead, and you're done. Super, super easy. Again, anyone can do this.